Hello guys, this is Eduardo. How are you? We are flying right now on flight level 320. And uh, today I will show you up uh, what we have uh, on the on the overhead uh, panel that uh, uh, we have over here. So uh, we have the, the main panel here. And uh, if you look, uh, if you look over uh, the roof, we have uh, a lot of uh, switches and buttons here. Okay, so um, uh, let's review what we have uh, uh, up here. Okay, so first of all, uh, the main the main switch that uh, we're gonna find here, it's uh, the battery. This is the uh, the battery. It's a three position switch, uh, on which uh, we have the on, the off, and the emergency position. Right, the normal position in flight is the on position. It will power up all the aircraft system. Okay. If we switch that to off, it will cut off the power from the battery. Okay. So that's uh that's the the main. Well, we can identify some uh, quick sections, which is the lightning over here. We can identify ice protection and fuel. Okay. That's gonna be it mainly how you can uh, identify what we have over here in the overhead pad. So, as you can notice, up here we, we got lighting, uh, so th these two are for uh, interior lighting, right? Uh, as you can see, there are some uh, some uh, uh, lights, lights here, that's off, that's on, right? And uh, these are these are dim, so these are for, for the cockpit light. These are exterior lighting, we have the navigation lights, articulation, which, which are the straw lights, Rotating beacon, and uh, we have these uh, these three, which are uh, uh, normally not used uh, during the day, and the recognition is used uh, only below uh, one zero thousand feet in order to uh, be seen. That's a big, big, uh, uh, bright light on the tail, and uh, the landing lights. Okay, these are the landing lights. As um, if, if you uh, take a look on the. Uh, the exterior of the beach yet you will find out that the, these landing lights are uh, uh, all the way up in front and uh, they pop out from uh, the, the fuselage and uh, so uh, these this switch will extend them and uh, over here down there we have an on off switch just for the lights all right so these will extend the lights off the fuselage and this will turn them on and off and now uh, we have the emergency lights there is a switch which uh, the normal position is the arm position we can test them on and we can turn them off if i turn them off i got an annunciation here see that we'll say uh, emergency lights not arm okay so that's an indication but this switch is in the off position, so normally it will go like that, and it, it will it will put in the arm position. All right. So that's that's the only thing. Okay. Now. So uh, now uh, Hugo, he's gonna show you up how the uh, fuel crossfit system works. So we we got three lights first, the two, and over here we got an annunciation that the cross fuel uh, system is working. And that 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 is uh, this is the reason that uh, we're using that. As you can see on the right tank, uh, there, there is more fuel than on the left. So in order to uh, consume, to get get uh, 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 a better rate uh, of uh, fuel consume, uh, we gotta we gotta use the fuel crossfit system. So you need to be uh, very careful with this because uh, uh, the the fuel it it will go down really fast. See that. Uh, the needles are coming uh, together, so uh, you, you you need to be uh, very careful uh, not to forget uh, the fuel crossfit system. Okay, so uh, let's go a little bit uh, up here. We got ice protection here for the engines, left and right, the wing, and the uh, horizontal st uh, stabilizer. We have uh, also the windshield heaters that are normally um, using the low position uh, during the whole flight. Okay, so that is. Uh, then we got here a little switch that will uh, will test uh, the airspeed. 
and uh, landing gear warnings. You hear that? That's a landing gear uh, warning. We cannot hear the the airspeed uh, uh, alert flight. Okay. Uh, this knob is used to test a whole bunch of uh, stuff. We can test the generators if they are online or not, the flap asymmetry detection system, fire detection system, stall warnings, standby power, and uh, you will get here an indication which is a uh, go and a go. You need to get a green light in order to, to, to be a, a, a good test, to pass a test. Indicator test light, if, if, I, if I turn it on, everything is gonna turn on, as you can see here. So um, all the lights over here, we can test them and see that they are working. Okay, so that's the uh, indicator lights test. Galley power will give uh, power to the coffee maker, uh, to the air show and uh, uh, the music. We got the XM radio back there. All right, so down here we have uh, uh, heaters for the angle of attack, the pitot left and right and the static ports. So those, those are our um, uh, actually so, uh, circuit breakers that will pop out if, uh, if something happens so that uh, if you see them that they're different right so that, that's, that's why they are also circuit breakers uh, for, for, the, for those systems alright and finally we got uh, here on the left the generator uh, reset the switches which uh, for a, a normal start uh, we will use them in the normal position if we have uh, the power auxiliary power unit, we'll use them in off position. See that off. If, um, if it happens that uh, generator is it, 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 uh, it's not working, we can reset them here. And then uh, we can check that here. We got uh, the ammeters for uh, the left and right generator. Right now they are having uh, a low charge, which is around 100 amps. Okay, so we, we can test also the bolts which, which uh, is going to be here, I can turn this knob for the right generator, the battery and the left generator, very good, okay. And uh, these two are for the inverters, uh, there are uh, some stuff in uh, the cockpit like uh, uh, the flap position indicator, the all temperature and low pressure uh, indicators and uh, some other stuff that uh, works with uh, AC, so the inverters are used for that. And finally we got some pumps, ignition switches, jet pumps, boost pumps, and fuel transfer pumps. Alright, see that uh, we are um, uh, using the crossfit now in the normal position, no lights appear, no pumps are, are on. Okay, uh, these fuel transfer uh, pumps are used to uh, pump out uh, fuel from the fuselage, fuel compartment, to the wings fuel tanks all right so uh, if, uh, if, if 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 we had to have uh, some uh, fuel in the main uh, in the fuselage uh, tank uh, these two will be on the fuel transfer pumps it will pump out uh, fuel to the to the wings all right so pretty much that's uh, what we got uh, up here in the panel uh, these dimmers are to control some lights oh I forgot something that you may like see this switch which has uh, safety and uh, flight uh, and the fast seal belts it will it will um, uh, show in the cockpit uh, uh, annunciations for the passengers in order them uh, to fasten the seat belts hope uh, you like uh, this video we covered the main uh, overhead panel up here and uh, hope you like the video I appreciate your comments see you later